iOS 14 is one of the biggest updates to iOS feature-wise since the release of iPhone. In Apple's most recent keynote, they showcased these software changes and improvements and released them to the public in a beta. So in today's video, I'll be showing you how to install the iOS slash iPadOS 14 beta to experience these changes and features for yourself. Hey everyone, I'm David and welcome to Affordable Tech. My channel revolves around showing the capabilities of high quality budget tech. So if you enjoy tech and like saving money, just make sure to subscribe. All right, so here I have the 7th Gen iPad, which is what I believe to be one of the best budget tech products on the market. Although this guide is being done with an iPad, it's practically an identical process for your iPhone. And just so you're aware, here's a list of compatible devices. For iPhone, it's basically from the iPhone success and up. And for the iPad, as you know, their naming scheme is super unorganized. There's so many devices on here, so just look for yourself. So before jumping into the install, I do want to mention that there are some potential downsides to installing a beta. The beta is not yet a fully optimized OS. So there will most likely be a decent amount of bugs that you'll experience and potentially data corruption. So just make sure you're prepared for potential crashes and unoptimized apps. For me, experiencing these features before their actual release is well worth it. And based on my experience with betas in the past, I really never came across any significant problems. So let's go ahead and jump into how to upgrade. So on your device, go ahead and open up Safari. Uh, you're going to want to search for beta.apple.com. Put that into the search bar. So here it is. And this brings you to a sign up page. Go ahead and sign up if you're new and sign in if you're already a member. Uh, so we're going to click sign up. So after putting in your password, uh, you'll be brought to this agreement. Click accept. And now you have a guide for public betas. Feel free to browse through and learn more about them. So now select the OS for the device you want to upgrade. We're going to click iPad OS and then scroll down. And underneath Get Started, there's going to be Enroll Your iPad. Obviously, if it's an iPhone, it's going to say Enroll Your iPhone. So we'll click on that. Now, the first step, Apple suggests you archive a backup. Here, they suggest you do it in Finder, just in case an issue occurs with the beta and you lose your data. That being said, you can also back up through iTunes. I usually just back up with iCloud as I have never experienced any issues when using a beta. And if anything were to happen, I'd be able to restore to a backup date from before I upgraded. So if you choose to, feel free to back up your device. Uh, but we're going to go ahead and continue. Step two is to download the profile. So click download profile, allow, and then it says the profile has been downloaded. So to view that profile, we're going to go home, go into settings, in general, scroll down to profile, and then here we can see the downloaded profile. So we'll click on that, and then we'll click install in this upper right corner. Type in a password if you have one. Click install again and install once again. Now it requires you to restart. So we'll click restart. Okay, now that it's restarted, let's go ahead and change the rotation. Okay, so we're not done yet. Go back into settings and then under general, you're gonna see software update. Click on that. And then once it checks for an update, the new iPad OS, as you can see here, iPad OS 14 public beta 2 is ready to download and install. So we'll go ahead and click on that. Type in your password once again. And then it begins downloading the update. Now we wait. We'll put a timer in the background to see just how long this process takes overall. All right, so the download only took maybe less than five minutes. Uh, then once that happened, it's going ahead to prepare the update. So just finished preparing the update. Uh, so now we're able to install it. Uh, the preparing the update part of it actually took quite a bit longer than I had expected. Uh, what we are at on the timer right now is 22 minutes. About five or so of that was downloading. Uh, so the rest was for preparing the update. So we're going to go ahead and click install now uh, and then see how long it takes from there. So it just powered back on and it says your iPad has been updated to iPadOS 14. Let's go ahead and uh, type in our passcode. 
Okay, just rotated the screen. And just to confirm, based on these widgets here, and also in settings, software version 14.0. And that's it. So there you go. You're now running Apple's newest beta. Explore it, have fun, and stay tuned for a full video of my thoughts and review of the iPadOS 14 beta on the 7th generation iPad. I hope you received some good value out of this video. A like would be much appreciated, and if you enjoy my content, feel free to subscribe. Thanks again, and I'll see you in a bit.